Hello guys and welcome to Luxie Temple. Wow, well, I mean, so just randomly it was like, I was up at Penang Hill and kind of coming back down. Gonna maybe walk here, I think it closes at like in about half an hour, or the, the sign down there it actually says it's 6.30, I read 5.30. We might be alright, might be alright, but I was just randomly walking down. You know, to get kind of home maybe, and then some taxi drivers were like, Oh, you wanna go Luxie, Luxie? And I was like, oh yeah, okay. And they're like, 20. I was like, mm, no, that's okay. And then another one said, 10. So I was like, what, 10? I can do 10. 10's fine. So yeah, we're here. Okay. Uh, can't tell you much about it just yet, because very unexpected to be here. So we're here. Let's uh, have a look around, eh? I know, like, the, like it's one thing I do know is it's like three layers. I didn't realize. I mean, I'm pretty lucky, actually. Uh, he drove me out because I thought I was gonna maybe walk here another time or something or maybe walk here um, and the it's up on a hill right and the the road up I saw some people walking it and they looked tired um, but yeah I know that it's a three tier so there's like this level that level and then there's another level around there and like the main I guess the main like event, I guess, or the main uh, thing is, uh, you can't see, but you can see the top of it. So this here is like a pagoda that actually covers a big brass statue. I hope, well, we'll get up here. Um, gosh, check it all out then. Check it all out this way. It's like multi-layered everywhere. It is a Buddhist temple, I believe. Um, you know, these things I should have really looked up, I guess. Anyway, we're going to have a look around. And while I look around, uh, I'll try and find some more uh, knowledge for you. Okay. they closed up that temple there it is like just on 5 30 now i've heard some gongs go as well which makes me think they're kind of closing maybe everything Whew. but a lot of it's still kind of open you know there's like the temples themselves which they close the doors wow where am i going okay no you can't go that way <laughs> so yes there was a gate there back there was closed so okay so I can't go up there anymore hmm okay looks like they are closing it all up such a shame got so close didn't even see like the I think it's the Buddha I'm not sure if it's a Buddha actually but this is definitely a Buddha statue this is actually the oldest Buddha statue in Malaysia I believe um, originally founded in 1870 or it might be 1890 uh, maybe I'll put down below. But yeah, there's so many levels to it. You can see, just, there's like this pagoda here. like they've uh, kind of closed the place up on me I was gonna try and get through there but obviously they've put gate there I've been around that way and it doesn't go anywhere so yeah they're kind of shutting down now they're shutting it down I thought like I could still get around the outside although you know when they start putting pink gates up like this they had turned all the lights off on that one as I was kind of getting in there I sort of got a few bit of footage for you um, yeah I looked at it all Really cool, like mosaics up on top. Mosaics? No, not mosaics. More like uh, like reliefs, you know. Um, 
kind of like wall reliefs up. Uh, looked like depicting maybe some um, story, I guess, of the Buddha. This is indeed the Buddhist temple. I didn't get to see the Buddha, which is actually the main kind of attraction for this. It's up on the hill and then it has like a kind of a protective pagoda over the top of it. Uh, it's a bronze statue up there. I believe it's a Buddha statue. I know this is a, a Buddhist uh, temple. Uh, it was founded in, I think it's 1890 or it might be 1870. Uh, it's actually the oldest Buddhist temple, I believe, uh, in, um, in Malaysia. If not Penang, Malaysia as well. Yeah, but I don't think it was this epic. Um, to start with, obviously they kind of, I guess, built tiers over the years. Um, I think it is also the biggest, perhaps in Malaysia. Maybe I'm getting all that confused, but I'll look it up and I'll maybe correct myself down the bottom. Um, yeah, I think, I think I'm correct. Uh, I think they turn all these lights on eventually, but obviously not till sunset. So, um, yeah, that's going to be in like a good two hours, I think. Not sure if I'm keen on waiting around that long, but see, just see, see this, that view is the pagoda, the, or like the kind of roof to where the Buddha, ah, that one's still open. There's still people there. Okay, I'm going to go. Gonna go, gonna go. Let's try. It's very hot. I feel like I'm rushing a bit. And they're closing everything up on me. Which is quite annoying. But also fair enough, you know. I've already kind of done one thing. I'm now trying to do this other thing. I think uh, Asha wants to see this as well. Like I'm obviously here by myself. Asha wants to see this as well. Oh, she'll definitely want to see this. I think we may come back tomorrow. Tomorrow is like our last full day <gasps> in Penang. Uh oh. Um, so I put it here. But yeah, I mean, if I can, if they allow me to continue walking around everywhere without either locking me out or locking me in, I'll hang around until the lights come on. Might be fun. Oh, gosh, I need to start running again. I don't run for about. A month. Just like from every wow, you just carved into the rock, eh? Everything. Every angle there's there's something. Wow. Now check this out. What is that here's surrounding it? Oh, didn't even see these guys. Wow, let's go up. More Buddha statues, okay. Okay, and just up here. Very tall. Gosh, so much here. I'm definitely gonna have to come back because, yeah, rushing around a Buddhist temple is not really the point going to a Buddhist temple, is it? It's very hot over them. I think it must be gonna rain soon. Must be what it is. It just got really hot. Just don't know if I can get up the top there. Sounds like a monkey around somewhere as well. Screaming. As a baby. Wow, okay. I don't know how to get up there. So yeah, I tried to climb up there and then this was locked. I was hoping to get there, but then get there, and then get up there. But it didn't work. They didn't close here, but maybe they're always closed. I don't know. Okay. 
I'm going to just do some filming. I'm going to slow down. Uh, if I can get up there, great. If not, probably coming back tomorrow anyway. Just here, unfortunately, kind of, there's the buggy station. So this is the buggy station, which goes up the Guam statue, which is like the bigger, the big, big statue. The buggy station, uh, cable car. Yeah, it even says, please use cable car. Please use cable car if you want to visit the statue. So this is station three, and we can go to station four. So, maybe I'm not getting up there today. Not sure there's another way out. I'm gonna just try and look around this edge of this building just to at least see the statue. But yeah, it looks like uh, we're I and we I we're all coming back. Let's see though. Ah, uh, you can see name. Oh well, guys, we almost made it. Gosh, yeah, look, this is like all no entry and stuff, so don't think I want to be going in there. Okay, cool. Well, I mean, it's still cool. It's still really cool. I mean, the, the statue is kind of like, you know, the piece, the, the bit, the cherry on the top. <laughs> piece de la resistance. Piece to resist. I. The thing, the good thing, it's the good thing on the top, but this place is still amazing, you know. Every kind of corner of it, you know, has something going on. It's like a water feature. Very cool. There's even like, it's just like golden statues just everywhere. Or golden colored. Maybe they're brass. But yes. Yeah, see, it looks like they're closing up this bit as well. notice this though that there is also a cable car so I guess the cable car goes right from the bottom all the way to the top okay good to know just found out so obviously this is the I thought the entrance right but apparently apparently you can go up here gosh I'm just walking around being locked out of everything apparently you just got to do more walking up 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 I hope I mean, one taxi driver who kind of wanted me to, well, pay him to drive me back down, basically. Um, he was the one that told me, so. You know, he wasn't getting much out of it, so I guess yeah, he's telling the truth. Looks like there's another entrance. Yes, okay. Oof, okay. Gosh. So you see this road? This is, yeah, it's. Oof, wouldn't want to be doing all of it, that's for sure. Lucky I got a taxi at least halfway. I think they took, so that was halfway. Okay. Now we know. Maybe they still let me in. People are still coming in, so I think so. And the lights aren't on yet, so let's see. Ah yes, yes. Yes, yes. See it even says. Ah oh, gosh. Gosh, you can keep going up here. Look at that. There's the entrance. Guan Yin statue. Guan Yin statue. Oh, dogs. <laughs> Who's this guy? Oh, no. Gosh, didn't like cameras. Okay, I think it's still closed. Maybe I can go up. Whew, okay, uh, we're getting somewhere. But you see just behind me, that's like the cable car that goes up. Whew. We're getting closer, people. We're getting closer. Actually, I didn't know. Okay, so I've made a few many errors. <laughs> so the statue is actually Guan 
Yin, right? Which is actually like the statue that we saw, Koh Samui. And the te temple that's in uh, Georgetown. So in Koh Samui, she's the goddess of compassion. In here, like uh, Penang, she's more the goddess of mercy. Now I guess, you know, mercy, compassion could be interchangeable depending on like the language difference, if you know what I mean. Oh my gosh, fuck. What a walk. Ah, I thought I was at the top, people. Great, great. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm going to have to stop filming. Bye. Yeah, it's closed. Visiting 5.30. So I probably just should have come straight here. Dang. Now we know. So there she's there. We can kind of see her a little bit. One, and as long as the steps she's at the back, up to you, you can see. Uh, there's the gate that is closed, <laughs> and there's Guan Yin up there. Let's just let's zoom in on her, shall we? Uh, there she is. And so I know that the, the like she was built like a long, quite a long time ago, and then they built the cloud up on top. Uh, wow, it looks like you can actually climb these stairs, maybe, and go right to the top. I don't know, I don't know. Um, closed. But this is actually one of Usher's favourite goddesses, I think. <laughs> so she would definitely want to come back. I mean, well, she would definitely want to come. Um, I didn't know that this was who that was. Super interesting, super interesting. I thought it was Buddha. I don't know why I thought it was Buddha. You know, you just think, okay, it's a big like metal statue at a buddhist temple it's gonna be buddha right no i was wrong but yeah cool uh you can even see here like there's quite a lot of engravings on this door and even i think as you walk around down there as well oh well, i guess like her stories you know but yeah i'm to close today already might have to come back hmm was it worth the walk up oh gosh not for a closed door but like she is epic she, I think she's one of the tallest standing bronze statues ever or something I don't know looks pretty tall anyway particularly from here um, but oh well maybe that's a tomorrow maybe that's a tomorrow <laughs>
Swanian is still not uh, lit up, but Wow, don't really understand why Guan Yin isn't lit up, but gosh, at least, gosh. Okay, I'm just going to film it, guys. I'm not going to talk. How amazing is this place? Blown away, obviously. Honestly, honestly, honestly. Blown away. Like we saw this, like when we came past, like a few days ago. Um, this was like, oh no, we won't go and see it, maybe another time. And gosh, I'm glad I did. Glad I did. I don't think we'll go, like we'll come back tomorrow, but I don't think we'll stay for the lights. But they're amazing. I just don't know where to look, like it's it. I mean you're probably getting exactly the same videos but just with the lights turned on instead I mean you yeah, even when I was walking here through here before like I didn't know, really know where to look just everywhere you looked it was infinitely amazing and now it is even more or it is even different it's unfortunate though that um, up up there, the Guan Yin statue isn't open. That's a real shame. But I guess we can save that one for Russia tomorrow. It's getting really hot. I'm getting really sweaty. I think I'm about done. Let's get going in a bit. too hot <laughs> uh, so I'm gonna head off um, yeah let's get going uh, I gotta catch a I think I, I can catch a grab like all the way home basically I just got to get all the way down the um, the other side of the building or well down the hill to like where the cable car goes from the very bottom I believe I think there's like a car park or something down there so I'm gonna go down there but apparently it only costs like 15 ringgit nothing I was looking at it, looking at it on grab. So yeah, we're gonna go down there. Let's go check that out. Let's see what we can do down there. Uh, there's also turtles down there, or tortoises. But I think they'll all be asleep by now. I don't know. But yeah, I'm getting really hot, really sweaty. I think that means it's gonna probably start raining and I don't wanna be here for that. Okay. popular actually um, more popular it seems at night than it is during the day now I am walking down the road in the dark luckily the traffic is going very slow because there's a lot of them I'm not sure where they're all gonna go actually don't know there's not much car I don't think there's a this many cars parks up there is there who knows okay well got a bit of a walk don't know why there wasn't steps or something down like a shortcut Maybe there is, but I just couldn't see it. Like, um, yeah, like a river. Okay, let's keep walking there. But look, pretty amazing to walk under with all these cars. Hmm, can do without, but at least they're not moving. At least they're not trying to hit me. Cool guys. Well, it's going to be a while, I think. And then I got to, yeah, it's basically because it wraps all the way down, back down around there. <sighs> okay. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it. Yes. Okay, guys. That was it. That's it. That's it. I'm going to end it here. That was Luxie or Cogluxna Kick Luxie.
temple. Um, thanks guys for watching. I've got a grab coming. It's going to be a while, but I've ordered him. It's only going to be like 13 ringgit. 13 ringgit from Georgetown, from like central George, well, two switch central Georgetown. I think we'll just do that tomorrow, just to get here and enjoy it. See the bus, maybe, maybe, maybe. 13, maybe it's 12 even, 12 ringgit. You know, that's like less than three pounds. Wow, less than a tube journey back in London. <laughs> Crazy. I'm going to go, guys. So, yeah, cheers. Thanks for watching. Why don't you consider subscribing? I'll see you on the next one. Until then, keep on drifting. Yeah.